welcome back to uh, wrestling as we have varsity versus the Calvert Hall Cardinals. I'm Gavin Sparzak, joined today by JD Farrow. What's up, guys? Um, we'll get started very shortly as uh, the captains come out. We will start off with the 106 weight class. All right, so we're going to start off with 106 with Abdullah Alcaran and Aiden Pulera. JD, what do you have to say on Abdullah? Abdullah, he's a very fine wrestler. Uh, he knows he, he's he's a little on the shorter side, but he makes up with that. He makes he makes that up with his strength. As we start, we're going to do a little hand fighting. Oh, he would have spun around. Abdullah is going to try going for a single leg. Get a nice little tie up. Oh. And uh, that's that'll be down. two for Aiden. Abdullah's got to get up now and get a point. He's closed. Just needs to face up. Ab oh, Abdullah oh, got him on his back. Him. Abdullah is getting the back points. Excuse me, into the legs. Abdullah's got to be careful. He's still holding on to the leg. There he goes, dude. 5 2. But. Aiden gets the reversal, gets two points, now 5-4. And Abdullah get by escape, it's a point for him. He's going to go in right again. And he comes in aggressive. Ab Abdullah going out with some aggression, he's got him in a tie up. He's trying to go for a single leg. So hold that leg in, good job. He's going to try spinning. He'll get the two. Pushing. There's a two. 17 seconds left in the first period. Eight to four. Abdullah doing good good so far. He's going to try working the half. He's got it in. So, Can so he just get him on his back? He's got him. Ed. Can he hold it? He's getting back points. Uh. Time runs out. Very great first period for Abdullah. Yeah. Student student section's going crazy for Abdullah <laughs> as he's winning 10-4. He's a he's not the biggest wrestler you'll ever see, but he's very feisty. And Calvert, Calvert Hall choose bottom. That means Abdullah's on top. See if Abdullah can get a good ride, but Calvert Hall they're gonna need to stand up and get out and try working for a takedown. Burg him down. Good job by Abdullah. Can he get him on his back? Get, he get does. The half, get the half. He's holding it. Calvin Hall's trying to fight out of it. He's uh, pulling back in. This could be big for Curly if they can get it. Cover Hall, Aiden, he's trying to fight out of it. Great fight by Aiden, really trying to stay off his back. Abdullah still trying to get him on his back, but Aiden gets out of it, but he'll get back, but Abdullah will get back points. He's now up 12-4. Couple more points and it may be a tech fall. Yeah. Which would still be big for Curly. Abdullah, he's still holding on to him. 
50 seconds left in the first. Or, I mean, second. Oh, that may be an illegal headlock there. Yep. Illegal headlock. Unfortunate. But, uh, they'll come back. Aiden's on bottom. Abdullah just needs to ride him out for another 40 seconds. Yeah. Aiden trying to get up. But Abdullah breaks him back down. Aiden. Good Matt return by Abdullah. Ooh, that, was a, that was a beautiful Matt return. 20 seconds left. Abdullah trying to hold on. He's got his leg. Gets around. Just needs to hold him out for another 10 seconds, and the period is his. Abdullah holding on. Five, four, three, two, one. Another great period. By, uh, another great period by Abdullah, able to ride him out the entire period. Yeah, keep him from scoring any points. Twelve, four. Abdullah's up on Aiden. Aiden's gonna ha need to have a big period. Abdullah is gonna try looking to finish him off, and either get and get some points on the board for Curly. Abdullah's on top once again. He's done. A good job riding him out. Just needs to do. Just needs to keep keep up the good work. He's got him flattened out. Now he needs to try working a half. That's what he's got to try doing. He's got the leg. Oh, he has. It. He needs to sink. He needs to sink it in. There you go. Wrap around the head. He's trying to hold him. He's definitely getting more back points. Abdullah holding. Aiden can't fight. Is that not a pin? Aiden's still on his back. He's showing no fight. Abdullah's holding him down. Ref. He's going to try oh. lifting his head. Aiden's still Abdul trying to fight to out of it. He's Abdullah needs to wrap, pick up that head, hold it tight. Uh, more back points, though, for Abdullah. That's going to bring it 15 4. He could get the tech. Abdullah's got him flattened out once again. Aiden needs to stand up. Ah, full uh, Nelson. Legal full Nelson. And I hate the full Nelson. Such a yeah, such a tough move to try to not do. Yeah. Sometimes it happens, but Dula just needs to play, it, just play it safe. Not give up anything. Not try. Not if he just doesn't get on his back or. Whatever. If he just doesn't give up stupid points, he should be fine. Yeah, another 50 seconds and he, he wins. He's trying to get the half. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh, a takedown. 30 Kavanaugh. seconds though. Aiden's going to need to try getting him on his back. Abdullah just needs to, just needs to stand up or hold or try not to let Aiden get him on his back. Abdul's about to get a stolen call. He needs to try to stand up or do something. Abdul is trying to stand up, but Aiden's holding on. Aiden only has 10 seconds. He needs to get him on his back. And four seconds left. Three, two, one, and that will do it. Great fight by Aiden, but just a little too late. So Curly will strike first as they'll go up 3-0 on Calvert Hall. Great match from both teams, but Abdullah comes out on top 15-7 over Calvert Hall's Aiden Polera. Next up will be 113 between Tim Stevens for Curly and Ty Hulk for Calvert Hall. Tim is a senior, but once again one of the many new wrestlers on this team. Still though, what what the the height he doesn't have he makes up for with his strength. He's yeah, very strong. Will he be able to demonstrate that strength now? A little bit of hand fighting. 
He tried Kim to hit a shot. It. Yeah, shot wasn't successful. Oh. Nice job scrambling by both guys. Tim's got his leg. Tim seems to try to fall back or Yeah. Tim's still got his leg. But Ty is gonna try Matt returning him. Tim's not letting him. He's showing his strength. Coach is telling him hips away, but oh. Ty gets him down. But down. Gets the points. Big down for Calvert Hall, but out of bounds. They get the two. Tim gets a fresh new start, but he's down, so just needs to stand up quick. Tim's going to try standing up. But so close. Ty is flattening him out, but Tim's going to try standing back up. He's going to try running it. Tim's holding on. Trying to do an arm bar. Tim's very slippery, though. He's able to. Tim's still fighting it. He's able to slide out of it. She's the. Oh, oh he's turned him over. Oh, Definitely oh. getting back points here. Tim's going to try to have to fight out of it, but Ty is holding him down. Can Tim fight out of it? Ah. Great fight by Tim, but just an unfortunate nine seconds left and Tim just can't get out of there. The yeah. winner is Ty Hawk from Calvert Hall and Calvert Hall will go up on top six to four now. Next up will be uh, the 120 weight class with Calvert Hall's Joshua Jackson and Curly's own Devin McKeeley. McGailey. McGailey. Devin, once again, another new wrestler. Brand new to it, but he's improved a lot this season. The work back center. Trevor Hall's wrestler's trying to be aggressive, but it's not really getting him anywhere. Ooh, good Ooh, take, take down. down. This is not good. Ooh. Illegal headlock. That's what it looks to be. So Devin will go bottom. Joshua will go top. Devin's going to try standing up. Joshua able to return him down. Devin needs to stand Devin. up. Oh, getting stacked. Able to fall, able to roll out of it. Good job, but Joshua will get back points. He's up five nothing now. Fifty seconds left in the period. Cradle, oh no, not a cradle. Got the cradle locked in. Devin's gonna try fighting out of it. Got to kick his leg out. Ah. And get the pin. Great fight by Devin, but cradles are deadly. Yeah, that was a great cradle by Calvert Hall's Joshua Jackson. But credit to Devin, he tried fighting out of it. So Calvert Hall will now go up 12-4. Curly is in need of some points. So Curly will forfeit at 126. So Griffin Stewart from Calvert Hall will get the forfeit. And they'll get another forfeit at 132. After this forfeit, Calvert Hall goes up by 12. Create making the deficit even larger yeah. currently. But 
will have a match this time. It will be with Curly's Adialua and uh, Calvert Hall's Matt Lombardo with the 138 weight class. Adialua has been on a roll recently. Let's see yeah. if he can continue that streak. He's been doing good lately. He's shown a lot of improvement. And he has great strength. Ooh. Oh no, he falls to his Slip. back. Slip. He needs to get off his back. He's trying to fight. He does get off his back. Calvert Hall will get two. Adialua needs to stand up as Matt from Coward Hall try holding him down. Looks like Matt may be trying to run in, run in an armbar. And he sinks it. Uh, oh, that's not good. And oh, he gets the pin. A minute 13 left in the period. Matt pins with Adialua. So unfortunately, Curly gives up another pin. And Matt from Calvert Hall will take the win. We'll now go to 144 weight class with Mason Janicki. Janicki and Jeff Fortune from Curly at 144. Now Jeff's a senior. He's a very good wrestler. I, I've experienced wrestling him. He's very strong and very skilled. Let's see if he'll be able to come out on top. Gurley definitely needs six. This is a big match that they want to climb back in it. Here we go. They're up in a tie. They're both going to circle. Oh, Jeff's going to go try for a snap. Doesn't work. Now Mason tries to shoot in on the legs, but Jeff's able to lock him, lock him out. Jeff's holding oh, him. Oh, whoa. Uh-oh. Jeff needs uh -oh. to be careful. Jeff needs to free that arm. Yep. Jeff is holding on to that arm pretty strong. He gets two, that two leg. hands on Mason's leg. Oh, but he uh. left. Mason's able to free that leg. Yep. Two points. Two nothing for Mason. Jeff needs to stand up. Mason's trying to run a half Nelson, but and he t rolls him over. Jeff tries to roll out of it, but Jeff's trying to roll. Jeff's trying to flip him. Uh, Jeff needs to get out of it. He's Mason trying scoops, his best. Mason scoops the head ah. and the pin. So another six for Calvert Hall. Uh, Mason Janicki from Cal from Calvert Hall will get the win over Jeff Fortune. Next will be 150 with Adam Malinowski from Calvert Hall versus Darren Liss from Archbishop Curley. Curly really needs to get a win here. We're down by 32, and we're in dire need of some points. Yeah, and six. They, they, well, they definitely need six. They're gonna. They need to go in a little streak of winning these next few matches. Try to fake them out. Uh, no. Good, good takedown from Adam. Adam gets a shot in. Has a little two on one. It looks like. Tries to do a ball and chain, but it not, isn't successful. Jeff's gonna, or not Jeff. Darren's gonna try. He's gonna have to stand up. 
Adams holding on tight to that two on one. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Dar Darren stands up. That's a point for him. Great job getting up by Darren. Now he's going to need to look for a takedown because Curly needs six. They're going to work back center. Been a hand fighting, but it's only 25 seconds left. Someone needs to do something. 2 1 score. Adam Malinowski is up. He's got Adam's gonna try for a takedown, doesn't work. Darren defends it well. Seven seconds left. And that'll bring us to the end of the first period. Two on score. Adam is up over Darren. Darren chooses on. Darren chooses bottom. That means Adam's on top. So Darren did a good job escaping the last time. Let's see if he can do that again. Oh, Looks great escape! Very quick. What was that? What, like it was like four seconds escape. That's yeah, crazy. that was a quick escape from Darren. Now he needs to get the work for a shot, get a takedown. Two two score. Getting close to the barrier and need a circle to uh Darren tries to get a shot. Good sprawl from Adam. But Darren's gonna get, he needs to get Adam as a wizard. Ah, I almost had it. Adam shoots in. He's able to he's able to get Darren to his stomach. It's two points for Adam. Darren's doing a good job getting up, and he's gonna need to get up here, especially down to two, with 50 seconds left in the second period. Darren's able to escape, gives him another point. All of Darren's points so far have come from escapes. Ref tells him to work center. Oh Darren tries for a headlock. That is a hip toss. He has it. He has it. He needs. They need six. He's getting. He's definitely getting back points. He needs to keep. Needs to. Oh, he put nine seconds though. Can Adam fight out of it? He's holding on tight. Three, two. Ah. ah. So close, but that gets Darren three back points. So Darren now takes the lead, eight four. Oh, also close from Darren. Adam was in some trouble, but got bailed out by the clock. Darren able, to, Darren able to ride him out. Strong tight waist on him. He's able to lock up that leg, keeping Adam down on his knees. Uh -oh. Darren's too high. Needs to. Oh. Mm. Fool Nelson. Another fool now. That's another fool Nelson call we've seen tonight. Curly. Or well, Darren needs to find a way to get six points. Whatever that might take. Adam Mumos gets up, but Darren's quick to break him back down. But on the flip side, Adam needs to get up and get a point because he's down by three. Ah, 
Adams getting up. And oh. it's eight six now. He's now down by two. With Fifty seconds left. It's gonna be close. There needs to be on the defense. Oh, two. Oh, we have no. a tie. It's tied now. Eight eight. If Darren can get an escape, that would be huge. <laughs> 20 seconds now. Darren needs to get up. Adam trying on the arm bar. Darren's able to defend it. Darren's fighting hard. Yeah, Darren's got to fight hard right now. He's got that locked in tight. Curly coach is going crazy. And it'll be one green now. Full Nelson. Full Nelson, that I don't even know We've what that was. Potentially <laughs> dangerous, maybe. I don't know. Head trapped right yeah. in between his legs. But it works out for Darren. Because it's now 10-8. Because Adam. now they need a takedown. Ten seconds left. Darren just needs to defend. Can Seven. Darren defend it? Can he sprawl? Tries, Adam tries to do a headlock. And he got it. And he makes it. That is huge for Curly. It may not be six, but it definitely gets him back in. Their it lead goes from four to seven. Definitely gets him back in the stool meet. It's now 36-7. So now we will move on to... Is it 160? So yeah, 150. Wait. One. No, 150. 157. One, yeah, 157 weight class. And we will have Balin Bouts. And Alexander. And Alexander. Sorry, we don't know how to pronounce your last name. So we'll just call you Alexander. <laughs> but Balin's going to try helping out Curly. Ba Balin's a very experienced wrestler. He's yeah. only a freshman, but yeah. he, he knows a lot about the game. Yeah. Out of bounds they go. Alexander going aggressive. Alexander going in for the shot. Galen sprawling. Oh. Could have been could have been bad right there. Luckily, Balin was able to get out. Alexander snaps Balin down, but isn't able to. Oh, great job. Great job from Balin. He gets two, but they go out of bounds. <laughs> Alexander on bottom, Balin on top. Let's hope Balin can ride him out. Ooh, beautiful that tight waist. That one will definitely hurt. Great able job to, from Balin. Able to keep him down. Really utilizing that tight weight spar ankle. Oh, Balin trying to go for his specialty, and that's the cradle. Just out of bounds. So Bailey can keep him down like like he did before. <laughs> Alexander galloping like a horse. Yep, and he goes out of bounds. So there'll be the so Alexander will go back on bottom. Bailey will go back on top. Fifty nine seconds left in the first period. Balin keeps the leg. Ooh, and Alexander tries to throw him down. Balin goes for the cradle. And, and stacks him. Alexander is able to roll out of that stack, but Balin goes right back to it. He's getting back points. Can he hold him down and get the six? And he got it. it! That was crazy. Yeah. Alexander is not happy about that one, but I know Balin surely is, as he now gets six for Curly, and they are right back in it. 36-13 now. 
for that 23 point deficit. Who's up next? We got, what, 160? 165 is Sisto Averno, Cam Hampton. And Cam Hampton from Curly. Cam Hampton's one of our captains. He's a very good wrestler. He also plays football, so he, he's a multi sport athlete and lots of experience. Let's see what he can do. Sister goes for the collar tie. Oh. oh. Cam needs to get out of that. Sister's able to throw him down for takedown. Gets two, but Cam rolls out of it. Sister is pulling Cam's arm tight, tries to roll him. Cam needs to get up. Sis Sisto is holding on tight though. Sisto goes to scoop Cam's arm. Looks like he's trying for an arm bar. One of the like the fifth arm bar we've seen tonight. Yeah. Potentially dangerous, so I think we would maybe I don't know. So Cam will go bottom. Score is still two nothing, fifty eight seconds left. He's gonna need to get up. Cam tries to get up, sister throws him back down. Sister trying to grab that far shoulder. Looks like he's going for a headlock now. Oh, Cam's oh. gonna try turning him. That's an illegal headlock. Could, uh, no? Uh, Cam almost turned right into him, and that would have been great, but he couldn't. Back points for Sis Sisto. Coach is telling uh, their coach is telling him to break him down, and he does. Eight seconds left in the uh, first. That'll end it. Just to be able to ride Cam out for the last, the last few seconds. Reds on bottom. He's curly. He's on top. We need this point. Bring the score. Oh, so wait. four nothing. Sisto is leading. Cam is able to throw yeah, down. Yeah, Cam. Cam is now. Or Sisto is now on the stomach. Cam needs to hold him. Sisto able to escape. Get a point for their team. Five nothing. Cam needs something. Oh, Ooh. good angle pick. Sisto takes Cam down for for two points. Ooh. Takes him out of bounds. <laughs> Sisto going aggressive as he got an ankle pick, let him back up, and just re-tackled him. Cam looks mad. Let's hope he can yeah. use that anger to get a pin. Yeah, 7 nothing now. It's all Sisto. Cam needs something. Tries to stand up. He's taken right back down. Sisto has a... Uh, Sisto headlock. now gets him on his back. This is not good. Here's a half Nelson. Holding it tight. So Cam needs to try with the roll out. He needs to roll out. So almost exactly have that. He's almost there. System holds him back down. There he goes. Yeah. Well, able to come out. So now they're up. So now Sisto's up 10 nothing. And Full Nelson. Cam needed a point and he got one. 
Let's hope he can get another one with an escape. Cam tries to switch. It's instant successful. 20 seconds left in the second. Sisto goes for arm bar. Needs five, four, three, two, one, and that'll end second period. Ten one, Sisto leads as he tries to help his team get some points back. Cam's on bottom. Let's hope he can get out and take him back down for more points. Cam needs something big. Cam so close to escaping. Sisto takes him right oh, back down. That's a great mat return by Sisto. Sisto is just trying to get some back points. Maybe trying to go for a tech fall. Two, two for Sisto. He's now up 12-1. And he hits him with the suck back. Cam just trying to fight. 14 to 1 now. Two more points and Sisto gets a tech fall. Cam just needs to keep fighting. Needs to stand up. Ah. Oh! Trying to turn him. Almost got it. But out of bounds. Yeah. They go out of bounds. Cam's back on bottom. Tries, Tries to, get, to get away. Sister is quick to cover though. And Sisto trying to add more to his lead. Uh, catches his arm. Cam trying to just try to find any way to get out of it. 30 seconds left. And and he'll get the tech fall. That raises Kevin Hall's lead by five points. So it's now 41-13. For Got to give credit to Cam, though. He he fought hard. Yeah, he put up a great fight. He's but now will be the... Uh, now will be 175 for... Yeah, now will be 175 with Duncan... Kamar, Kamar uh, against Matt Tooman from Curly. Matt fa famously known for his headlock hip throws. Let's see if he can hit it. He does it all the time in practice. I'd say Matt's probably one of the most like one of the best wrestlers we have in our yeah program. It's, oh, oh tried it there. wasn't wasn't able to go through. Was able to stay off his back and. Doesn't allow the two points. Both guys aggressive. Oh, good oh. ankle pick. No. Duncan gets the two. Matt fighting to get out from bottom. Duncan tries the arm oh. bar. He's trying to s have Matt on his back. Out of bounds. Mm. 
Matt is trying to get out. Duncan grabs a leg. He's trying to pull as hard as he can. Matt able to break that grip. Duncan. Duncan pushing Matt to his back. Matt's got to get up to his feet. Matt's got it. Oh. And another pin. Duncan. Duncan's able to pin Matt. Get another six for Calvert Hall. So Man. Duncan will win that one. Extends Calvert Hall's lead. 47-13. So now, theoretically, they won, but... Curly will just try finishing strong as I be believe it's 190. It's 195. That Khalil Regan and Khalil Regan against either Howard Odo or James Cousins. Uh, not sure which one. Uh, Khalil's one of the older wrestlers we have in our room. Doesn't mean he's not not good, but Khalil, Khalil's crazy man. Yeah, very very strong. Yeah. He looks like there might be some blood. Yeah, blood came from Matt Tuman, who is our athletic trainer. Mr. McGinty checks him out, and they'll try getting the blood wiped up. All right, now we can start. So here we go. Oh, they come Calvin out Hall quick. Starts so strong, trying to break him down. Give it, big, give it a take down. Khalil now on bottom, to try to fight his way up. Trying to get hand control. Well, Calvert Hall is trying to run the half Nelson. Khalil needs to stand up, get a point back, but Calvert Hall is holding on strong. Looks like he's maybe trying to crab ride him. He's holding him down. And he's hitting back points. Trying to stretch him out. But Khalil's fighting his heart. Khalil's fighting it. He's getting a lot of back points. Khalil turns out of it, though. That's a brief count with all. Make him score 5 0. Khalil trying to fight out of it. Just needs to hold on for another 30 seconds. <laughs> 20 seconds. Can Khalil fight out of it as they go out of bounds? Coach is telling him he's got to get up right up, right off the whistle. Needs to fire up. Take him, take Capital back down. Capital's trying to use the same move. Looks like Khalil's trying to, look like Khalil's growing like a resistance to it. Three seconds left and that will do it. Signs of the first period. Five nothing Calvert Hall as Great fight by Khalil so far, able to stay off his back and just just limit the score to back points only. Yep. Calvert Hall's on bottom, Khalil's on top. 
Khalil is a... He, he has a lot of strength. Let's see if he can use that to his advantage to hold him down. Capital tries to come up. Khalil is able to force him back down. Let's see if he can try getting him on his back. Khalil is trying to grab some hand control. Trying to roll him over, it looks like. Khalil is holding on tight. Khalil's going a little far far up. You know, may, may need to come back a little bit just so the cover hog guy doesn't buck him up and throw him over. Oh, Ooh, that's Kevin not Hall good. Back to the headlock. Khalil, Khalil's on his back. Khalil's got to fight out of it any way he can. Trying his hardest to fight out. Calvert Hall's got it tight. Coach is telling him to turn. 40 seconds left. Not a pin yet. Uh, and Khalil's able to roll out of it. Great that job. Was, that was a great fight right there. When you're on your back like that, you just try to fight out of it, and that's exactly what Khalil did. And they go out of bounds. 33 seconds left in the second period. Khalil's going to try standing up. Cabral okay, grabs wrist control. Tries to wrap around the head. Try to go for a cradle, it looks like. Oh, and he got it's it. it. Got it in. 11 seconds. Khalil just. Ah. Oh. Oh. Great fight by Khalil. How he almost got pinned earlier, but he's able to hold out and muscle it off. So 53 13. Cover Hall up. We're now down to 215 with Calvert Hall's Maxwell Garland versus Curly's Brandon Lewis. Let's see, Calvert Maxwell goes off, tries to power up, but it Brandon's able to fight it off. Doing some top. Brandon gets an underhook. Tries to throw him over. Maybe grab that. Go for like a single leg, but Maxwell's able to clamp down. Brandon wraps the head. Coach is telling him to bring him to the mat. Brandon could do like a, a cement mixer. Oh, oh Maxwell shoots through the leg. That that almost was going to be a great takedown by Coward Hall's Maxwell Garland, but great defense by Brandon Lewis. Trying to fight. Brandon, ah, almost got it. Almost had something right there. Brandon's able to fight it off though. Right now they have collar ties. Just trying to lock it up. Twenty seconds left. Let's see if someone can get maybe a takedown in. Scores tied 0-0. Looks like it will stay 0-0 until second second period. Yep. Seven seconds left, and that will close out the first period. Great fight by both teams, able to fight off each other's attacks and. 
So, 0-0, zero, zero, Brandon chooses bottom, and Calvert Hall, or Maxwell, will have to ride. Brandon tries to fight his way up. Maxwell locks his legs. Chops the arm. Looks Brandon trying to get up. Almost there. Falls locking back down, hands. locking hands. So it's a point for Brandon. Sometimes you just need a little luck like that. Brandon does. We'll have to go back on bottom, but he's got himself a point. Brandon can stand up, that'll make it two, and then that means that Max will have to get a takedown to tie it up. Brandon tries to grab the arm, Maxwell throws it away. Tries to roll him over, isn't, su isn't successful. Maxwell tries to force Brandon's head down. And Ooh. there we go. Brandon gets a takedown. Great reversal by Brandon. Three nothing now. Fifty seconds left. Brandon just needs a ride. Brandon is trying to hold him down, trying to keep him from scoring any points. Uh, but he, get, but Maxwell gets the escape. Good escape. Three one. Twenty seconds left. Brandon trying gonna try working for a takedown. Same thing with Max. But they got out of bounds. Brandon's up by two right now. Let's hope he can get some more points to solidify his lead. Oh Axel tries to shoot in. Brandon defends it. Looks like Maxwell may have a leg though. Brandon gonna try cross spacing and getting around. Yeah, Brandon can cross space and grab that ankle. He can force Maxwell off of him to get a takedown. Good defense by Brandon though. Prevents the takedown. He's still up 3 1. And Max will be on bottom. Maxwell tries to spin out of it. Brandon locks him down. Has an arm bar. Looks like. Ooh, Good. Maxwell tries to grab Brandon's head. Let's go. Minute 30 left in the period. Oh. oh! A reversal from Maxwell. So 3-3 three, three now. Brandon needs to get an escape to take the retake the lead. Brandon needs to get up. Maxwell trying to hold him down. Maxwell just lets him up. That. Could come back to uh, could come back to haunt him. Brandon, Brandon got a leg. cross face. Oh, oh no. that's bad for Brandon, and he's got him down flat. It's five four, but Brandon just needs to get out. But it's forty seconds left. Let's see, will Brandon be able to get out? Brandon's got to get out. He's got to get out. Thirty Maxwell seconds has now. That leg locked up, and that looks like he may have like a tight waist or have a. Lock Lock hands. Hands. Oh my. Wow. Tough break for Max, but it's 5 5 now, 30 seconds left. If Brandon can get out, he'll be up and he'll just have to defend. Brandon tries to go for a switch. 
20 seconds. Maxwell's able to lock Gonna it try down. getting up. Ah, did not Maxwell. return. Brings him back down. Maxwell may just try to ride him out until the period ends to go into overtime. Or trying to... Can Brandon get up though? Six seconds, five, four, three, two, one. And we will go into overtime. Five, five, first takedown wins. First takedown wins. They get a minute. Yeah, first takedown wins. Let's let's see. Maxwell uh -oh. tries to go for it. He just needs a spin. Brandon needs a spin. Spins it. He's got oh, it. Got it. Oh, He's let's got go. it. Brandon's got it. Brandon takes the win on this one. Great, great fight by Maxwell, but they're very equally matched. This is. Yeah, some of the, some of these matches that go into overtime can be some of the most yeah. interesting and the most involving. Next up is the 285 weight class, which is the last and final weight class. Will be Kevin Bright from Curly, and nobody's listed from Calvert Hall, but they have somebody wrestling out there. Kevin, he's also another he's another football player wrestler. First year, but he's shown a lot. He's, he, it's his first year, but he's really good. Uh, Trevor Hall trying to grab a hand, maybe trying to set a shot up. Uh, Calver Hall is going to try going in for a shot. Kevin's able to defend it. Uh oh. Can Kevin? Ooh, can Kevin? Oh, uh, oh no! Good play oh, by Kevin. He's he got what is he back. Him. Him. He's got him. He just got to hold him. He has back points. Ah, oh. oh. that's not that's 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 They're gonna keep wrestling. Everybody's confused. The ref doesn't even know what's happening. The clock was messed up from last period. Oh, last match. The clock was still on from last match. So the period ended early. Oh, tough break from Kev for Kevin. They, th th so the coach from Curly, Coach Tim, was gonna have a talk with the ref. Looks like they got some stuff figured out. Kevin's not happy about it, understandably, because he just had that man pinned. The ref telling the scorekeeper to put a minute back on the clock. A minute back, yeah, a minute back on the clock. So. I wonder if they'll just go neutral. Nope. Calvin Hall will go on bottom. Kevin, Kevin's a big man. He's able to, let's see if he's able to use his weight to keep him down. Ooh, tries to go for a switch. Ah, locking hands. Locking hands oh, and no. he's going to give up the reversal. And he gets Kevin, try, Kevin fighting to get off his back. Is he able to fight? Is he able to fight it off? Uh, no, he's not. And Kevin loses by pin. Oh, man. Great fight by Kevin, but not able to fight it off. That's just that's just unfortunate. If the clock was never like that, Kevin might have won a lot earlier. Yeah. But uh, I believe that will do it. As Coach Tim from Curly will have a talk with the ref. Understand and understandably why I would not be happy about that one either. Kevin had him pinned, but final score. From this dual meet between Coverhall and Curly, Coverhall will take it 59 to 16. But great, great battle from both teams. Uh, I know Curly didn't come out on top, but a lot of their guys showed heart. And same thing from Coverhall. Like from yeah. some of the guys that that they that didn't win from them, they showed a lot of heart. Yeah, it was just, a, just an overall great dual meet. Yeah, we thank Calver we make we thank Calvert Hall for making the uh, journey out here to wrestle us and. It's a great fight. We'll see y'all on the next live stream. It was fun tonight. See you next time.